It's the third time the Chancellor has changed his mind this week. He's political editor Andy Bell is outside number 11 Downing Street for us now. And Andy, you can see behind you the bunting's up. The government don't have too much... ...thing that we all enjoy, I certainly do. Uh, how feasible is this advice? I mean, do you really see people pouring themselves a tiny glass of wine or a quarter of a pint of beer a night? No, not at all. I, mean, I, don't, I don't think this... For everyone sitting at home watching this, probably with a nice glass of wine, hopefully, saying actually a glass of red wine is good for your heart, it's good for your health. Who do we believe we drink too much and are, and are abusing alcohol? Because the vast majority of us do mm. drink quite sensibly, don't we? Drink tonight? Quite possibly. <laughs> good stuff. Eric, thanks very much for joining us. Eric Appleby there from Alcohol Concern. to see you, Graham. Thanks so much for coming That's in. That's no problem. Does that give you goosebumps looking at that footage? Uh, I don't want to look at it. I've seen it so many times. <laughs> well, a little bit, yeah. Uh, basically, we were out there trying to tag uh, taupe, which are bottom-feeding species, and we attract the shark. Was she dragging us or were we following her? No, most big sharks are females, but the stronger ones are... A decent so let's hook, have a look at this. Is, so you've got this hook. Well, that's all let's that's left of it the camera. This, uh, so that is the hook that use that. Um, well, obviously it's a hook shape, yeah. but there's so much pressure. You, you managed to tag her. We think that she's pregnant. I am not a fishing expert, but I thought it looked a little cruel. Is it or not? Well, how are we going to learn with the migration patterns? Well, it's not a radar tag. That's a data information right. cylinder. Same time tomorrow night. Bye bye.